Hello everyone, this is Wick and today I'm going to show you something great. I'm going to change this image to this. Starting from beginning to the end and I'm going to show you every process and how to do it. Very easy. The only thing you have to do is that just follow the steps and do the same thing I'm going to show you. By the way, subscribe to my page and let's just be friends. Okay, so this is the image. I've drawn just a couple of videos on my page and people love that but I'm gonna show something different about this image so first all the thing you need to do right now is um, press um, Control plus J okay to duplicate this image J and another and another so make it four okay so we're gonna start from this one okay so all you're gonna do is that we're going to switch this one this to to by two to um spot um healing brush to take this just follow it i'm gonna show you everything you understand so just take all this out like this she will just make it like this okay okay so um i think you just need to do the same thing okay so i'm think i'm i'm done with this okay so all the thing you're gonna do it again is to duplicate it or you can just make the shortcuts around here duplicate and hit OK and that's it and uh, we're going to choose this brush make a brush this one and the eyedropper to, to get the skin tone color I prefer to choose the same I mean the skin I mean a skin tone color so you need to just do the same then I'll go back to my brush mix a brush and you can make here five but I prefer to make it 80 because I know how to use it and I'm gonna work it with this so fast so just watch it okay so this is how it's gonna be first but you have to start learning how to use this brush okay I'll show you everything about this image and this side we are just doing it make sure you just pull the side inside you will make it look I mean the same natural okay but I trust you all can do this okay how are you saying it so let's check before and after okay and here too or you can use to cover all this lines so you can just leave this I think um, this one is a natural thing now you can just clean it whatever just like it to be so let me just make it come back again on just um, take it like this
so I think I'm almost just done with this okay so when you're done with this we're done with this and let me just um, show you the before and after before and after when we're done with this all you thing you're gonna do is that you're going to drag this one this one the second one to the top here okay so let's check before and after so when you're done with it you're going to um to you just go to uh, image adjustments heal and saturation okay and turn this saturation off okay and then hit okay and move to filter and come to order and high pass and make sure you just make it correct okay so let's say um 2.1 is okay and let's hit okay and switch the normal to you know lights have you seen it great so check it before and after and if you want to make it more just duplicate it Control J to add another one okay but I think this one's not not good so we're going to go back again again I mean so to the black and white to add more okay so um, let me just make it um, let's say three okay three is not bad then I'll was, I was just turn it to the light and boom that's it it looks natural so let's go for the this, this is the first one and this is the second one okay so when you're done with it make sure you hold control and the down one and control G to add them together so right now this one is together and duplicate it again so when you're done with this you're going to clean this the eye you're going to clean it you can make it um, an easy way like you crop you choose this brush okay and you can make it like this an easy way control J to cut it and move to adjustments black and white okay and hit ok and choose eraser tool and stop in the middle okay and stop in the middle and clean this side so make sure this brush is going to be it's going to be around zero the hardness is going to be around zero then you clean this side okay so let's check before and after okay so you come to this one too and make it the same thing control J to cut it and move to image adjustment black and white step it okay and clean the middle and the side like this and add this hold control control hold control and add them together like this so check before and after that's it so i'm going to show you how to do that dodge and bend on the face i mean on the face and so let's just add this together i love to add them together because I don't spend time on this but you can just group them all I mean how are you gonna do it 
so this is how I'm going to create my dodging band. I'm going to choose this brush, go to OK, and I'm going to make the exposure to be around 70 and step the nose where it's just shining and brightening. So I prefer to make it like this. So you can just make it the same thing. OK. So this is how I used to do it all the time. And step here. Okay. So I think here's the colors I've just changed. So we're going to use the hydro pot to, uh, to to get this side um skin color the same and just move to um color replacement and increase the stain and step on it to get the same area I mean the same color grading I mean the same t uh, skin tone grade and that's it so let's check before and after so I'm going to turn this one a little down okay so when done with it, just add them together, like I just said. And let's just move to the mouth here. Control J. So when done with this, just move to adjustment. Um, here and saturation, and increase this one. Okay. Increase it like this. Or you can just move this one around like this too. But so I just want to get the skin and how it's going to be cool and natural. So that's it. Check before and after. And you move to eraser too and just clean around here. And re let's just reduce it a little and see before and after. Before and after. That's great. And add them together and control J to duplicate it. So when you're done with this, we're going to um work with the face and how to create it and get it so clean. So all this we're gonna do is that we're going to move to um filter and camera raw camera is my favorite um i mean my favorite i used to just create to i mean do my skin tone and how i used to grade all my stuffs because i love it 100 percent so easy to use so um she can just do the same thing too so i hope you get a face everything how is you going to do it so so this is the so this is the um so this is the final um thing we just want to do so let's just move to um color mixer and move to the the red so if you want to do it just check it or just increase it and see how it's going to work for you when you make it like this, you can just move around like this and check which one is just dope and cool. So I'm going to take this one to 10, plus 10. And here it's going to be, let's say, um, 55. And move to orange and try to increase this. Okay. So when you do it, um, I mean, when you do it like this, Make sure you just make it in a good way that it's going to look nice. So I'll turn this one to negative 10. Okay, negative 10. And check before and after. Okay. Before and after. And move to yellow. Then increase the situation. To be around 60. And the heel um, supposed to be around, let's say, negative 50 and that's it before after 
and move to move to green and increase this one and let's see which one is going to fit it so I'm going to choose this one negative um, 72 and the situation will be around 100 and I think this is good and let's move to basic to control this so I'll just come to the blocks here and I'll make sure this one's going to be around 30 and I shadow a little bit around plus 12 and this one's going to be around 15 how is going to be around 15 and this one to be around 3 so let's check the before and after okay and let's just move to the optics to I mean to make the side inside dark here just increase this one a little bit like this that's good before and after wow so this is great before and after and hit ok let's check the face yeah so guys um i'm awake and like this video i mean comment and just like and share to your friends and i'm gonna draw more videos for you guys to just learn a lot of things so see you for the next video bye